Tammy Blair, and welcome to Beauty Connection. Today we're in the salon with a few stylists and a makeup artist, and we're talking about formals. We have a couple people in today getting done and getting ready for their big day, and we're going to discuss the hottest trends that are going on right now. Hi, Amy. Hi, how are you? Good. So I know formal is one of the busiest times in the salon, yes. and I know we have a lot of them coming up. So can you tell us a little bit about some of the hottest trends that are happening with formal this year? Okay, so with Angie, she has very fine hair, so what we end up doing was just loosely kind of pinning it up, giving her some volume up on the top, and just kind of sweeping it to the side so that it actually looks like she has a little bit more hair than she actually does to give her that, you know, glam look that she would like. Yeah, that looks great with um, also a strapless dress as yeah. well. It's nice to have, I think, some hair sitting on, uh, on your shoulders. So. Yeah, okay. just loose and fun. Great, and I see that Jody's doing her makeup. Tell us a little bit about some makeup trends with formal. Uh, this year we have, we're seeing a lot of bright pinks and purples, um, a lot of patched out colors. We just got the new Joy collection in, so that's what I put on Ange here. Some nice bright pink lips and um, some purple eyes to match. Yeah, it really makes her pop. She looks great. Mm -hmm. So I know we have some other people in the salon getting, uh, that has had their hair done today. So Nicole, tell us a little bit about what you've done today on your model Alex. Well, because Alex has nice natural curly hair, we decided to work with her natural hair texture um, so that her hair will stay in all night and uh, just really soft and natural. We wanted to show off as many curls as we can. So Yeah, that looks wonderful. Again, a strapless dress, so the hair looks great when it's sitting on the shoulders. It doesn't make you feel so naked and it looks glamorous with a strapless dress, so I really suggest something um, nice on the shoulders if you have a strapless dress for formal. Amy, tell us a little bit about what um, Emily has happening with her hair today. Well, Emily has a very glamorous, sparkly dress, so we really wanted to bring out, you know, more of a glamorous, old Hollywood, very clean, chic for her hair, especially for her hair texture, because it is very thick. So we yeah. wanted to kind of get it all up and just make it really nice and glamorous looking. Yeah, that looks gorgeous. So I understand that fine uh, hair types are great to kind of have like a classic chignon look. Yes. Absolutely, and just add a little bit of spray shine to it just to kind of make it look even shinier. Okay, great. So there are some great trends, but if you have short hair, don't think that we're leaving you out either. We have another model here, Kayla, and we just did something really funky and fun with her. So Kayla has a strapless dress as well, but um, I know that we tried to do something really trendy with Kayla's hair today. Jody, tell us a bit about what we did with Kayla. Well, we just washed and blow dried her hair. She has nice bob hair. Yeah, it looks yeah. nice because people are getting those short haircuts too, so it's something nice that they can do with mm -hmm. their hair too. Great. So there you have it. There are some trends for your formal, and if you have a prom coming up, I would suggest calling your favorite salon and booking something really quick. I know that bookings happen to get booked up very early. I know moms are always spoiling their daughters, so if you haven't had your hair appointment booked yet or your makeup, I suggest getting on that right away. Thank you for joining us this time on Beauty Connection, and we'll see you next time.